Welcome to Excel Magic Trick number 669. Hey, if you want to download this workbook and follow along, click on my YouTube channel and click on my college website link and you can download the workbook Excel Magic Trick 661 to 671. All of these videos in this workbook are all about the new aggregate function, aggregate only in 2010. We are nearing the end of this 11 video series. This is just a quick note. There, you, you can't do 3D cell references when you're doing the aggregate. So when we have aggregate, and if we wanted the uh, sum, comma, and uh, we wanted to ignore nothing, comma, and then we wanted in our reference to do a 3D cell reference. I click over here and a 3D cell reference means you're adding across sheets. So B1, I have these little templates you can see right here, each one of them, and I need to add up all the January. So the way you do it is you click on the first sheet, hold shift, click on the last one, you can see our syntax for uh, 3D cell references. Right, so I'm trying to add across these sheets. When I can enter, it's just never going to let me do it in a million years. That's it. That's all that, uh, that this video is about. No 3D cell references. If you like, if you've never seen 3D cell references before, just search for 3D cell references. I have some videos on that. Aggregate, uh, I saved the, um, the, the worst one for second to last, the penultimate, and then the, the last one, 70 here, 71 doesn't exist, 70 have an amazing array formula that the aggregate formula can handle. All right, we'll see you next video.